this is my first time. I've come here for my exhibition. I'm actually here at Gallery Patrice Van Doors at the opening of my exhibition and lots of people have come and it's uh, been fantastic and I'm very, very happy. I love it. It's amazing. I'm going to come again. Beautiful country, very friendly people. And, you know, the Pakistani community is uh, really thriving here. You know, um, they're very, very liked. Um, they're doing good work. They're representing their country. They're very proud of their art. So I think it's a, it's a beautiful merger of two different cultures. I started painting, actually I started sketching, you know, maybe when I was, um, I don't know, 19 or 20. I used to always often on sketch and I used to, I used to live in Karachi, so I used to sketch Karachi. And when I would travel to Lahore, I would sketch the Punjab landscape. And I love sketching, you know, Karachi made the sea. Obviously we have a beautiful beach in Lahore, flowers, um, Islamabad, you know, the landscape, the mountains. And um, slowly I started filling color. So, you know, sketch me rang bhare. Then I started to paint those and with time it just became a profession. I went to an art school. I think uh, Pakistan and uh, Pakistani landscape ins inspired me. I don't have a particular inspiration but every day living in a country where I saw the landscape and I found it very beautiful. I saw the sea which had so many rich colors that I think living in Pakistan is what inspired me, the landscape. Um, my work is, I suppose, in a sense, it has been classified as social political. It's definitely social. It's about my country. It's about the environment. It's about Pakistan. But I feel it's not politically loaded content as opposed to um, it. It opens a dialogue because, you know, when you talk about Pakistan and when you say what is Pakistan and what does Pakistan represent, then certain images that come to your mind, this is a different perspective. This is a perspective of an insider. I live in Pakistan, I am Pakistani, um, you know, I love the country and it's my perspective on living there. So it is socio-political in the sense that it challenges notions, um, preconceived notions. So in that sense, it's debatable. Um, I love lots of different Pakistani artists, but I would say Ustad Allah Baksh and uh, Sadiq and Saab sketches, these are my favorite artists. I think Vincent van Gogh was sensational. I think his work, his museum, his sketches, it was so full of life. And because he never sold in his life, he was not commercial. So he used to make art for art's sake. You know, you can say for the purity of it, not with any intent to make money, but because he loved his landscape and he loved painting and sketching. So I think it's, it's quite unique and uh, nice work by him. I think um, it's a little unpredictable and I think if an artist decides to make an income from their art, some months you might make more, some months you make less. When you have an exhibition you sell more, um, otherwise from your studio or whether you do or not. But it's a little unpredictable. I think artists should maintain a day job just to keep disciplined. Also I think that you should not think about money because that, you know, your work will get compromised. So, you know, if you make good art, your paintings will sell. It might take time and it, it I'm about, I've had about 16 shows. So it's taken a few years and uh, then your name gets established. And then you have collectors. So, you know, if you do your first exhibition and you expect to be a huge hit and to have lots of money, it doesn't work that way, you know. I think in Pakistan there's a lot of awareness. I think what we need is a little bit of um, funding from the government so that we can open a nice museum and artists can have scholarships and more opportunities. So there's awareness. We just need a little bit of um, you know support from the government. Uh, well, uh, thank you so much, uh, uh, first of all. Uh, let me express our deep appreciation uh, for, for you, for the organizers and, and, and uh, you know, for supporting the civil. I think it's an excellent opportunity, uh, particularly, I think, uh, for Pakistan, um, that uh, we have not only been able to you know, bring uh, one of our uh, most talented artists here today with us. Um, thank you once again, uh, Elizabeth, for presenting our artists here. Uh, As you can see, I'm here in the Netherlands, so there is obviously support. 
Um, so the government does support, but obviously they are busy. They, they, there's a lot going on in Pakistan right now. So their attention is on other issues. But I think that we need to maybe push a little bit more and then tell them that this is a priority and that they will invest more in art. <laughs> I think they're very pleasantly surprised. I think um, you know they don't expect to meet a woman from Pakistan, artist, you know, independent. So it's very you know different from what they thought they knew. So it makes them think that okay, if you know Suraya is a Pakistani young successful artist, and you know maybe we should find out more about Pakistan. Maybe it's an open country. It's liberal. Women can work here. They have. They are given chances or opportunities. So we should, you know, like two or three people here just came up to me and they said they'd like to come to Pakistan and invest there and, uh, you know, explore and come to my studio. So I think that it, it serves very positively. I think they think that if somebody like her can find success there, then it's probably a good country to work with. I think this painting that you can see over here, which is called uh, Breaking Dawn, it's it's actually a very unusual painting. It's a painting of Karachi. So this is my view from my home. Every day I get to see the sea. So I see a beautiful beach in Karachi. And you know, we see the mangroves and we have these very slim kind of trees. And you know, in fact, we had uh, the ambassador here, um, the Netherlands uh, ambassador, and he was saying, he's been to Pakistan a few times. And he said, this is a, a Karachi interpretation. And he said that, you know, I see it and the blue, and the colors of the sky remind him so much of being in Karachi and the mangroves and the beauty of the city. So I think it's something that I can say is, you know, very important for me. And it's a very, very special work and I'm very proud of it. I have not yet, but I'm going to as soon as my exhibition's over. Today is going to be a really busy day for me, lots of people coming. But um, as soon as it's over, I'm definitely going to all the museums and galleries. So. Uh -huh.